All right, hey guys, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I just got back from uh, Las Vegas, Nevada for uh, Evil 2014, and this is my second year going. Actually, my second year, yeah. And hopefully next year, which will be my third year, hopefully, which I will be going back for Evil 2015. Uh, for those of you who missed it um, or watched it live via stream, I'm pretty sure all of, most of you saw the results. And for those of you who couldn't attend to e for those of you who couldn't attend to Evo because of uh, you know financial situations, like you know you don't have you don't have enough money to go, you live too far. Um, there's also like you know you have to take care of your family or something like that. You have some personal business, so like you know it's, I'm pretty sure there are legit reasons, but I can. Like uh, you know, there are fine re there are fine reasons to not to unable to go or not go. So you know, I'm I understand that. But uh, for those who did or yeah, for those for those who missed it or like you know never had never had had a chance to experience Evo. Um, this year's Evo was actually really exciting. It was really exciting. We had a chance to I had a chance to uh, meet a uh, Harada who is the producer of Tekken. And also, uh, I forgot what was the name of Blaze Blue. Uh, the creator of Blaze Blue uh, also met Ed Boone for uh, his latest um, in uh, his latest trailer for you know a teaser for Mortal Kombat 10, which is going to be he uh, showed uh, apparently three different styles of a uh, you know uh, Raiden, and of course there's also was another character called uh, let's see what's that called. I forgot what was his name, but I think he might be the successor or the son of Shao Kahn. And uh, there was also the, there was also a trailer of Tekken Seven, and where I mentioned, uh, let's see, yeah, trailer of Tekken Seven. If you guys want to see that, I'll post a link under the video below. And same thing applies to Mortal Kombat Ten. I'll post every single link under the video below, so you guys can go check that out. And also there was a uh, let me see. Season two of Killer Instinct, where we I had a chance to play TJ Combo, which of course, which of course, like you know, most of you probably saw it. So, uh, I had a chance to play him, and he was actually he plays really different compared to the original TJ Combo. So, it'll be interesting to see uh, what his final build will be. Obviously, it's currently in a development right now, so you know, it's in its early stage. And also another character they announced was Amaya from uh, Killer Instinct 2. So, let's see. Yeah, yeah uh, her design and everything, it just flat out changed. So everything about her is completely different. She went from an Amazon woman to, you know, like one of those, uh, uh, like, you know, one of those future, like, you know, those from the, like, you know, from the future or something like that. And let's see what else I forget. I think I said Tekken 7, and uh, let's see who else. Uh, I think that's about it of what happened in the deal dealer dealer's room. Oh, I also had a chance to play uh, some of the new uh, games that uh, that was put there. I think one of them was a Rise of, Incarn Rise of the Incarnates. Uh, there was also Athletes, which which was like a beat em up. Like a side scroller beat 'em up game, uh, kind of like Monopoly. It's kind of like a combination of a, a lot of games. So, you know, I don't know if it's in release yet. So maybe they might put it in Steam later. So who knows what the, what's gonna happen? And Rise of the Carnage, uh, I think it was kind of like a combination of a Gundam and also mm, Virtual One. But that's just my take on it. And also I had a chance to look at Persona 4 Ultimate Arena. So I'm not I never actually touched the game before, so if you guys have any knowledge about per, about Persona 4 or Persona game in general, just post a look up post a comment under the video below and uh, I'll take a look at it. Let's see what else. What else that happened in the dealer room? I think that's most that's mostly it. I think that was mostly it. and I also played a Jojo JoJo's. I think that's mainly mainly what happened. So, and also, and here's what happened at the tournament for those of you who couldn't go or you watched it via stream. Just a long, just a long took the Ultimate Marvel 3 tournament, which was actually a really exciting tournament. 
And I'm kind of funny when you get the builder for about 90 degrees or something like that. Uh, let's see. Shaohai won K13 tournament over Takedo. And let's see what else. Blaze Blue, I forgot what the player's name was. I really don't know what the player's name was. Uh, yeah, you, you guys have to fresh me up on that since I barely played Blaze Blue. And uh, let's see. Yeah, there was pretty much everything everything from beginning of day one to day to, to the end. Everything was just really exciting. Like, uh, I'm hoping to go back next year, so, you know, to get more knowledge and, you know, to actually uh, socialize with the other gamers, so, you know, so then we, people have more, more stuff to talk about. So, I think uh, that's pretty much it, guys, and before I end this video, I have a special surprise for you all. So, what I have here in my hand, whoops, I have here in my hand the official... Killer Instinct Redemption Code for the Xbox One. So for those of you who are interested in getting this, like you know, you can actually have the full game, and also with the uh, Shadow Jago. So it comes with everything. Just the uh, just the Killer Instinct for the Xbox One. If you guys want to enter this, go ahead and like this video. On um, go ahead and like this video. Comment under the video below and share this via Facebook, uh, Twitter. Instagram, any, anywhere that you feel is important for you to enter this contest, and and I will announce the winners next uh, next what did I say uh, next Wednesday. I will announce the winners next Wednesday, so you guys will like you know you guys all of you guys will have an opportunity to uh, to win. So, but there's all, there can only be one winner. So you know if you guys want if you guys have an interest in entering this, uh, just. Do everything that um, I instructed, uh, so you guys, you know, can actually get this game. So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I will. For, for, if you want to see more content, uh, subscribe to my channel, Facebook. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Steam, and also follow me on Twitch because I will be streaming probably just probably at the end of the month or next month. So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, Thank you for watching, and I will see you all later.